Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It is a beautiful Thursday morning here in Austin, Texas. This is day 723 of the Three Plus Minutes Blanks Challenge. And as always, I am filled with gratitude. Thoughts on my mind this morning. Actually, the thought on my mind this morning is a question. Um, I'd love to hear some of your responses and answers. Um, recently had a conversation with my ex-wife. Um, it's something that she said before and um, it's always been something that's bothered me. And so I, I try to process it um, a lot internally uh, with really close friends and family and with my therapist. Um, I've dealt with certain traumas my whole life, um, pretty much my whole life. Um, and the truth of the matter is they were so hard to deal with that I essentially ran away from them. Like I just didn't confront them. So one of the things my ex-wife had told me was, um, that she didn't feel that I loved her enough to deal with the traumas. You see, the traumas acted upon, I believe, some of her own traumas and her own insecurities from her past. And um, me not dealing with my traumas brought about insecurities in her. She felt like I didn't love her enough to deal with my traumas. And she gave me ample opportunities to work with it. Please let me not put that upon her. And the truth of the matter is these are things that I should have worked on myself, I think, personally before I got married. But something about the way she stated it to me has always kind of bothered me. That I didn't love her enough and I was selfish to not deal with my issues because of my fears and my insecurities to do them to help her. And um, I don't know, that's a, sometimes at moments when I think about it, it's a tough pill to swallow. Because I, I think, actually, in my head, it wasn't about being egotistical. It wasn't about not loving her enough. I just didn't know how to do it. And that's not an excuse. That's not a oh, Ron, you're right in all of this. It's none of that. It's just, it took a turning moment in my life to understand. And it took losing her to finally say, there's something wrong with you, Ron. Let's work at it. And here's the truth of the matter. I'm still dealing with it. And quite possibly may deal with it for the rest of my life. But I am now in a space that I'm not running away from it. But all of that to be said, I'd love to hear your responses. I'd love to hear, I, you know, I'd love to hear different perspectives. I am not always right. And so, you know, I put it before you. Uh, as always, be blessed today and every day. Talk to you soon. Peace.